Hi everyone, I'm Pragya and I'm back with a new story from the series of Angelina, Angelina and Henry, written by Catherine Holabert and illustrated by Helen Craig. Angelina could hardly wait to go camping in the Big Cat Mountains with Uncle Louis. I will dance under the stars, she smiled as she spun around the room. Little cousin Henry showed off his Panama hat. I am going to be a great explorer, he announced. Are you fit and fearless? Uncle Louis asked with a wink. Big Cat could still be up there. They set off early the next morning with Mrs. Mouseling's cheese crumpets still warm in their pockets. At first, Angelina skipped and twilled along the winding trail. Then she noticed Uncle Louis disappearing up the mountain and had to race to catch up. As they climbed higher and higher and Angelina began to feel very hot and tired. Henry happily jogged ahead of her. You are too slow, Angelina, he teased. Big cat will get you. My backpack is so heavy, moaned Angelina. Only another mile or two to go, Uncle Louis encouraged her. At last, they reached the top of the mountain and Angelina collapsed with a sigh. We have got to set up camp before sunset, said Uncle Louis, showing Angelina and Henry how to unpack. Can we have our campfire now? Angelina asked hopefully. You will need to collect some wood. Uncle Louis replied while I put up the tents. Henry scrambled off into the trees. Let's explore, he shouted waving a stick. We have to get the firewood first, Angelina reminded him. But it was much more fun exploring and soon the two little mouselings were deep in the forest. They played hide and seek and showed fighting and then they discovered a secret fort. Before long, they would forgotten all about Uncle Louis and collecting firewood. When they finally stopped to look around, the forest was growing dark and shadowy. The wind was beginning to whistle and strange shapes loomed behind the trees. Henry dropped the stick. I am hungry, he whimpered. Meow, something hollowed behind them. What's that? Henry squeaked. He grabbed Angelina's tail. Two large ears twitched behind a tree. It's just a shadow, whispered Angelina, pulling Henry into the fort. A black tail flashed by in the wind. The cat is coming, wailed Henry, hiding his eyes. We will just have to be brave, said Angelina as she leaped out into the dark night, shh, 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 she shouted, waving her sword. Rain pelted down and thunder roared. Then lightning stuck and a big branch crashed to the ground. Big Cat vanished. Poor Henry's whiskers were trembling. Angelina held him close and while the storm raged around them, she made up songs and silly jokes to comfort him. Finally, the wild winds passed. Angelina was soaking wet, but she would kept Henry cozy and warm. She gathered him up and set off through the woods, calling for Uncle Louis. Suddenly, Angelina stopped. Two yellow eyes were glinting through the trees. Angelina, Henry, thank goodness you are safe. It was Uncle Louis with two lanterns. He hugged the little mouselings and then carried Henry to the campsite with Angelina lightening the way. They all made the bonfire together and had a great feast of chestnuts and cheddar burgers. Angelina and Henry promised Uncle Louis they would never run off again and they told him all about their scary adventure. After supper, Uncle Louis played tunes on his Concertina, while Angelina and Henry danced around the campfire. 
before bedtime they set off under the stars i lost my panama hat henry said sadly but we really scared of old big cat didn't we yes angelina agreed and that's because we are both fit and fearless explorer this was the story hope you enjoyed it if you like it then please follow my page and subscribe to my channel thanks for